What is up guys, JigsawFlex here, welcome to Super Mario Run on iOS. Today I'll be showing you guys brief gameplay of the game, what you can expect from it, and my personal experiences of the game thus far. Um, I tried it actually briefly today, and actually at the Apple Store a few days back, did not include a demo gameplay somehow, just because I was not thinking about it at the time, I was just thinking, oh my god, I need to play this game, like right now. And the experience was a lot better on an iPhone 7 Plus, so if you guys have Plus at any chance and an iPhone 7, great, it runs flawlessly, it looks beautiful. And obviously the display is a little bit better on that, but um, I'm, today I'm going to be playing with the iPhone 6, my, my cell phone itself. So that's the only device I own that's Apple besides my MacBook Pro that is not a tablet of source. So um, I did a little bit of World 1 today, like I said. And now actually, after beating it the first time, you guys are able to do it again. Instead of getting pink coins, you get the purple coins. Which I'm guessing now I can compare my rankings with the friends I've added uh, after beating it the first time. I guess that's how it works. And uh, here we were uh, earlier on this page, which is basically the castle grounds. We can um, customize your castle, which is kind of like if you guys are familiar with... Fire Emblem Fates or Fire Emblem Awakening. No, just Fire Emblem Fates, yeah. Uh, Birthright, Conquest, or Revelations. You guys are able to basically create something in your castle. Um, different things you can interact in it, like buildings and probably random NPCs once you get them uh, to join your castle. And you're able to do stuff that will basically allow you to do more things and make your experience a little bit better and maybe help you out through the game with whatever cool stuff they have installed like right now it's very vague i know but like i have no recollection of like what we can actually do um in the actual nintendo world castle whatever you want to call this so briefly toad rally is right here um if you connect it to your nintendo network um, ID, you'll basically be able, I'm guessing, to see all your friends over there. Um, and you could go ahead and do that if you really want to. So add me on Nintendo Network ID if you guys want to verse me sometime in this game. I don't know how it works. I'll probably try that out later in another video or right now. But, uh, I want to actually just show you guys World 1-1 because who doesn't like World 1-1? I'm going to see if I can look at my Elgato. My, my phone fell like completely. Okay, I'm restarting again <laughs> because my dock fell and I already like screwed up like a thousand times. All right, so we got the first purple coin. Um, I think the I think they're in a little bit different uh, spot now. Oh boy, how am I supposed to get this? Let's jump! Oh, I need to get big if I want to get the other coins. There you go. All right, so... The purple coins are in a different spot this time. Makes the game a little harder, which I like a lot. I missed that. Oh, come on, let's get that. Yes! Alright, so what I like about Mario Run is the fact that you only can use one, you know, touch. And you can't, like, move to wherever you want to go. So you gotta actually really think of where you want to achieve to. So, right, we saw over there I used my ability to wall jump backwards in order... Ooh, I did not, I got lucky that purple coin was over there. But yeah, use that to your advantage, that way you can go backwards. And there are actually some platforms in this game where you're able to go backwards, like a block that shows an indication that you can go backwards, like a little backwards arrow. And little things like that will be able to enhance the gameplay and uh, where you want to land and stuff like that. So there wasn't really anything like special about that one, but uh world 1-3 i think has that so i'm actually gonna skip to that and show you guys what i mean by these little blocks helping you out so let's go ahead and try to get the purple coins over here um if i'm not mistaken it should be coming up after this part right here i really yeah there it is okay so right here those type of blocks allow you to long jump in this game and what you saw over there was a bubble where if you die, you get sent back in bubble form. Just like in New Super Mario Bros, um, you're able to do that with your friends. So, uh, let's just hope I don't miss that. Oh, uh, I missed that last one. That, that kind of sucks. And I missed that. Oh, no, I did not miss that one. All right. Uh, this is, this is kind of tough. I, I missed two already. 
And then this one is a stop block, where it's like red in the beginning, it's like a little pause symbol. And what it is, if you land on it, it will pause Mario and it allows you to think before you can jump. Um, it will only jump once you tap again. So, that's how it works. This is already a lot harder than the first time around playing this, so if you guys got the pink coins and you haven't tried out the purple coin mission, that is a lot harder as you can tell. So, wow, that that's what it is. Okay, so, let's see, what do I want to do? Do I want to do, go back, yeah, I think I'm going to go back to 1-2, that way we can do this. And by the way guys, this took me a long time to figure out how to record this. I was not able to record this, like, for the longest time, dude, because... Is there one down there? I hope there's not one down. Because I was trying to originally record all this in OBS. Because, you know, I have the layout and everything sorted out. And I can, like, add my... Um... Oh, gosh. Come on, make that jump. Okay. I'm allowed to put, like, everything in there. My layout, my Elgato software in it and everything. And, um... My video just started la I, I I missed that one down there. I don't know if I even can get that. Can I? Yeah, there's no way I can. Oh, well. And so they started lagging and I couldn't record my gameplay, which is basically the heart of this video. I know the webcam's extra, but like, the gameplay is a primer. And, oh gosh, no, come on, let's make that. Oh, nice. Oh. Okay, we missed one. We missed one so far. It's okay. And so what I'm doing is recording through... Um, Elgato and OBS, so hopefully they will end up really good. And I died. <laughs> I was not looking at the screen, I was looking at myself in the OBS to see if it was not lagging. So, this setup is whack. Like, I have to have two programs up. Oh my gosh, I just lagged over there, wow. Okay, let's not die. How am I supposed to make that? Alright, I have one life left, I cannot screw this up. Alright, nice. Alright, let's go! Oh, that was really tough. Oh no, how am I supposed to get this one? Come on. Oh, no. Nope. I will make this. No. I need more jump. I need more jump. There you go. All right. Cool. I got it. Um, yeah, so please leave a like on today's video if you guys are enjoying this at any costs because uh, I took a lot of time to record this video. I think I started wanting to record this around like 1 p.m. And it's already currently like 5 so, I don't know why it took me such a long time to do that, but... Oh, here! Super Mario Run is here! Oh, thanks for the notification. I, I put notifications on. So that way, it'll tell me, hey, Super Mario Run's out, get it now, and I just got the no notification. That's kind of pissing me off. Alright, so, I think what I'm going to do is do a little bit of Toad Rally, because I want to see how to use this. Um, I, by the way, I have 43, so when you have purchase the game, they give you a good amount. Um, I got gift boxes, so it gave me, like, extra things. Kind of like Mitomo in a sense, where, um, when you open it, you get, like, free packages and stuff like that. But, uh, since I made a purchase of $10 for this game, I got, uh, extra Toad Rally tickets. So, let's go pick an opponent and see what I can do over here. Alright, so... Okay, Nintendo. I'm versing Nintendo's, uh... Person. It's kind of like in Mario Kart Wii, they have like Nintendo people to verse in the time trials and stuff like that, so... Let's have Mario Parkour! In style! Let's do this. Okay, let's do this. Oh, so this is the Toad Run. Okay, I see what it is. They're, they're actually like made of paper too. It's kind of funny. Alright, let's do that. And let's not miss anything good. Alright, I got that. Let's go up here. Get that coin. Ooh. Can I get that? All right, coin rush. All right, I got that. More coins for me. All right, let's get. Oh, okay, I barely made that. Wow. All right, I'm gonna miss the coin rush now. All right, coin rush over. Not too bad actually. I kind of like this. Um, let's go ahead and make this jump, and then. Oh, come on! I missed the star. That's where the star is. But at least there's a half waypoint. So in case I screw up, I'm good. All right, let's do this and get that one over there. And more coins, so this is actually pretty fun. Not gonna lie, guys. You guys definitely should get this. Worth your $10, I think, so far. Um, I feel like I'll get... Have this some addition. Addiction. Um, the new Pokemon Go? Huh? I mean, Nimi Tomo didn't do well, so, like... Well, it did do decently well, but not as well as... Good as, uh... Pokemon. Wow, how, how much time do I have left? Oh, four seconds? I feel like I was, like, repeating the level over and over again. I think that's what it is. The level just keeps going and going until 
it stops the time, but that was pretty fun. Really good. I don't know if this will be Pokemon Go, though, because, like, a lot of people really like that. And I don't know if Mario, if Mario will be that successful. So hopefully, Nintendo, you guys are going the right direction. People will like your stuff. I personally like it. I'm a Mario fan. I enjoy this a lot. I keep getting all these pink coins. I got a lot more people. Wow. Oh, 420! Let's go, 420! Alright, so that was a really good one. Um, that's really fun. Um... Now, hopefully, I can be able to get these toads. Wow, I got 31 toads. They're all going to join my castle right now. I'm probably going to play one more level, and I'll probably do 2-1. You guys want to see 2-1? I think you guys want to see 2-1. 2-1 uh, actually looks really cool. It has a boo in the icon, so I'm definitely going to do that and end today's video. Uh, I want to keep these, level, uh, not levels, these videos a little shorter than usual just because... Uh, I want to have you guys be able to see what I will install in a video. That way, it's not too long. You brought some toads. Excellent. With more friends like these, you'll be able to rebuild your kingdom. All right. So, I'll probably do that in the next episode. I want to play one more level, dude. Um, the Bowser level is really hard. I'll probably do that in the next episode. I know I'm doing these out of order, but I'm just doing this on uh, what looks really fun to me. So, hopefully, Ghost Door Deception isn't... Oof, too bad. Oh my god. What is this? I gotta think! Oh god. Can I go around? Awesome, I do go around. Alright. I want that mushroom. Um. Man, yeah, I can see this game being really successful. This is really fun. This looks really fun. Why did I hit that door? Okay. So when you tap again, um, you enter the door. Oh god. Yeah, that was bad. How am I supposed to time that? Oh no, so it, I think it automatically puts you inside. That's kind of lame. Alright, so I'm gonna go this way. And hope the boo doesn't kill me over here. I want to jump over that. Because I don't want to go inside the door just yet. I really want that pink coin. Alright, so cool, we're here. Oh gosh. Oh no, let's go inside. Woo! Woo! That was scary! I don't want to get killed by the boo man. Ooh, there's a coin over there. Um, where do I go? Okay, this is a little confusing. You guys gotta really think to play this game right now. Um, let's go inside that door. No, 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 no. Okay, that's the wrong door. Good. I really did not want to go inside. It's a little weird having yourself automatically go inside doors. Well, they should have made it where you gotta tap to open doors. But you know, I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. Is there a mushroom there? There's none. Crap. How do I go down? Shoot. This is actually tough. Just don't die. Oh! Holy crap! Did you see that? Oh! Ho, skills! How am I supposed to make this? Shoot. I already have 70 seconds left to beat this level. Four seconds? Oh! Maybe I have to wall jump this. Damn, that's actually tough. All right, guys, we're back here. I'm actually still big. So hopefully being big will make it a little bit better for me to touch the walls a little bit better. I don't, I'm not sure if that will happen at all at some point. Oh, wait, what? I'm in another room already. That was the door I was supposed to go into and somehow I went in it. I'm already a little confused. <laughs> wow, okay, so I'll probably get that another time then. Oh no. I don't even know where the hell I'm going. Where am I supposed to go to get that those coins? Oh, right here. Okay. Oh, no. What? Oh, I'm supposed to hold, I think. Right? Yeah, there you go. Okay, that's how I get that. And then I take this. And then I gotta fall right here. Let's go inside that door? I'm guessing that's the right one. It looks like the right one. Awesome! Alright, so I actually beat the level. Not the way I wanted to, but hey. That's the point of Super Mario Run. You gotta think and see how you can get to certain paths without looking backwards. So, um, I guess that's the end of this gameplay video. I hope you guys really enjoyed this. Add me on Nintendo Network ID if you guys want to play with me. It is JigsawFlex. That again, um, my name is Kirk. And be sure to leave a like on today's video if you guys enjoyed. And subscribe for more Super Mario Run. So, in the next episode, I'll...
probably be able to do some more to Toad Rally. Um, it'll all depend actually on the comments below. If you guys want to see more Super Mario Run, be sure to comment below what kind of stuff you want to see. More of the worlds, more of Rally, or more of the uh, Nintendo Castle Grounds. I guess you would say, the, the ca my castle. <laughs> I don't know if it's just my castle or not, or, or castle build, castle builder. I'll just say more castle builder. How about that? So, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, guys, and stay cool. <laughs> Super Mario Maker is an anchor tool for many aspiring game designers. It's also a game that allows the casual audience to be creative and to show their polished work to the Mario Maker universe. Thousands of levels are being played daily and get really popular due to originality. However, not all of these ingenious levels receive the same recognition. That is why today, I want to share five...